Hi everybody, it's uh, Jake from UGCS.com. Uh, today, as you can see, I got here a, a few uh, vertical juicers and angel juicer. Uh, this is because a lot of you have been asking uh, if we can show the, uh, the comparison video between these uh, two systems. So basically, this is uh, what we will be doing today. Okay, so uh, we got a uh, one kilo of carrots here, and we will be juicing this. So let's let's see the results. So we have finished with the, with the carrots and let's take a look at the results. Okay, so let's take a look at the results, what we got. On the angel side we got a uh, weight of 697 and juice yield of 6, uh, 690 and on the right side we got uh, a weight of 475 and a juice yield of uh, 470 milliliters. Okay, and now we will take a look at the bulb. Okay, so uh, on the angel side we have a weight of 214 and on the right side we get a weight of 486 grams. Uh, some of you might know that uh, the vertical system normally gives you a little bit more pulpier juice. So uh, to give you just an idea what the difference in the juice structure might be, uh, we would like to strain the juice through the strainer and show you how much pulp remained in, 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 in the juice. As the pulp normally sits at the bottom of the uh, juice collector, we'll just make a little bit mix here. So, as you can see, we got here uh, one full spoon of a pulp in the juice. You shouldn't forget that the engine juice gave us a little, little bit more juice than, than the right side. So. Now we will strain the right side, the vertical system.
can see that there was even that there was a little bit less juice we got even more pulp in the juice okay so now we got uh, 700 grams of lettuce so we will make some green juice So uh, we have finished with uh, the green juice. Let's see how much juice do we get. Okay, so let's see how much uh, juice do we get. Uh, on the angel side we have a weight of 585 and a juice yield of 590. And on the right side we have a weight of 416 and a juice yield of 410. Okay, now we will check the pot. So on the angel side we got a weight of 51 grams and on the right side we got a weight of 40 grams. Uh, what should be also note is uh, that there is not much pulp uh, inside the angel juicer as you can see. Whereas there is quite a lot of pulp remained in the uh, vertical system. Okay, so now we will juice uh, one kilo of oranges. Let's take a look at how much juice do we have. Okay, so let's take a look at the uh, yield. Here we got a weight of 772 grams and the juice yield of uh, 740 
And on the right side we have a weight of 747 and a juice yield of 720. Okay, and now let's take a look at the bulb. So on the angel side we got a weight of 110 and on the right side we have a weight of 219. So now we will juice uh, one kilo of apples. Okay, so that's it. Let's see how much juice do we get from the apples. Okay, so let's take a look at the results. On the angel side we have a, a weight of 801 and a juice yield would be let's say 730 and on the right side we have a weight of 742 and the juice yield yeah hard to say maybe somewhere around 700 let's say. Now we will take a look at the bulb. Okay, now we will take a look at the bulb. On the engine side we have a weight of 80 grams and on the right side we have a weight of uh, 191. Okay guys, so that was it for today. Uh, we hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you're looking for more, more detailed information you can visit our website eujuices.com or you can also visit our Facebook website uh, which is uh, facebook.com slash eujuices. Thank you for, for viewing and bye bye.